guys, we're, we're finally married on our nine year anniversary of all days. Like, today could not be more special. It really, really couldn't. I would just like to start by thanking everyone for being here tonight to celebrate our magical evening, honestly. Each and every one of you are here because we value you. I value you one way or another. Uh, thank you to all the wedding party. You girls look absolutely amazing. I could not imagine a better hype squad. I suppose these folks look alright tonight, don't they? Uh, without them, I wouldn't be who I am. Sorry, everyone. <laughs> Another two people so perfect for each other. I'm gonna cry, you guys. Shayla, you are a bright, loving, positive, and wonderful person, and you deserve the most wonderful man of your life. Too bad you said yes to Corey. <laughs> Corey, you're a lucky man to marry my daughter. <laughs> and I couldn't ask for a better son in law. You have always shown us time and time again how much you love and care for Shayla and that means the world to us. It's been an absolute honour watching the two of you grow from a couple of kids in love to the most beautiful, unbreakable married couple I see in front of me today. First time Shayla brought her friend, Corey, around to our home. Brony and I knew he was going to be the one. Shayla denied there was anything going on there. They were friends. And here we are, nine years later, celebrating their vows, and we couldn't be prouder. Shayla Nicole, you truly are one of a kind. The moment I properly met you, I knew that you would be in my life forever. I just didn't realise it would be in this capacity. But God, I am so glad that it is. You make it so easy to love you, and I don't believe there is anyone who could love you more, except maybe the cats. <laughs> I always knew I was weird, and I always thought, where I come from, there's no way I'm the only one. And I was so right. You are right there with me in being weird and obscure. I couldn't ask for a weirder, more insane person to be with. You continuously make me laugh and smile just being, well, just by being you. Even if it is you being an idiot out in public. We have always felt right. It has been such a roller coaster, and it has all led to today being the biggest day of our lives. And I'm so glad we are here. You have inspired me to be such a better person and to always do the right thing. I love you so much, and as it has been and will continue to be, home can be anywhere when I am holding you. I love you more than anything. I can take you back to the moment I knew you were my forever person. It was nine years ago today. We were driving down Anderson Walk listening to Fall Out Boy. I turned to you and said, you want to make this official? Since the day we met, I've been so lucky, falling more in love with you as every day goes by. You're such a genuinely kind-hearted, selfless and passionate person. You've really helped me grow as a person and I'm so thankful to you for that. There are so many things that I love about you, Corey. You have this ability to be friends with everyone, to always find that common ground and make people feel heard. You care so deeply about the people you love. It's truly inspiring to see you love so unconditionally, to love with no boundaries or restrictions, to love with your whole heart and more. I truly believe that the reason I'm able to love so deeply is because you taught me what true love is. I 
life together is truly the definition of love. It's constant laughter and making unforgettable memories while standing by each other with nothing but endless love and support. Corey, you have been the best friend I could have ever dreamt of. You've been my shoulder to cry on, my rock, my biggest supporter. To know you is to love you, and I feel so damn lucky that I get to stand by you through life and be your person. How lucky am I that, I, that on our nine year anniversary, I get to marry the love of my life. The best cat dad in the world, the Peter to my Wendy, and my soulmate. Marrying you has been the easiest decision I've ever made. I can't wait to spend the rest of my life loving you with my whole heart and soul. After all this time, always. I've seen you both at your worst, but I've also been lucky enough to watch how the two of you continually build each other up and love one another so unconditionally. As the father of the bride, I'm very proud and it's an honour and a privilege to walk my firstborn down the aisle and give her away today. I'm filled with mixed emotions, but above all, I'm filled with love and gratitude. I'm not crying. Yes, you are. I can see it in your eyes. <laughs> Shayla, you'll always be my little girl and I will always be here for you in every step of your journey. Hayley, although you can't be with us today, we know that you're here spiritually. We really, really do. I just want to thank you for having such a wonderful daughter and help shape this woman that I have married today. Corey. Thank you for loving Shayla the way that you do. The way you look at her like she's the only woman in the world fills my heart with so much warmth and solidifies the fact that I know she will always be safe with you. You are kind, friendly, funny, amazing, charming. <laughs> Sorry Shayla, I can't read your handwriting. What does this say? Corey, do you take Shayla in marriage? Do you promise to love her, respect her, be honest with her, and stand by her through whatever may come so that you may share the rest of your lives together? <laughs> yeah, 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 we're good. Yeah, yeah, I <laughs> Let's get this party started. Let's just enjoy the night and everybody have a good one. Shayla, do you take Corey in marriage? Do you promise to love him, respect him, be honest with him and stand by him through whatever may come so that you may share the rest of your lives together? Well, duh. <laughs> <laughs>